It rains solid diamonds on Uranus and Neptune. Scientists have long speculated that the extreme pressure in this region might split the molecules into atoms of hydrogen and carbon, the latter of which then crystallize to form diamonds. These diamonds were thought to sink like rain through the ocean until they hit the solid core. Deep within the hearts of Neptune and Uranus, it could be raining diamonds. The scientists have produced new experimental evidence showing how this could be possible. The intense heat and pressure of thousands of kilometers below the surface of these ice giants should split apart hydrocarbon compounds, while the carbon compressing into diamonds and sinking even deeper towards the planetary cores. The new experiment used the X-ray laser for the most precise measurements of how this diamond rain process should occur. And it is found that the carbon transition directly into crystalline diamond. Neptune and Uranus are most poorly understood planets in the solar system. They are prohibitively far from our Earth. Only a single space probe, Voyager 2, has even be close to them. And also it is not dedicated for the long term mission. The atmospheres of Neptune and Uranus are primarily made of hydrogen and helium and also with a small amount of methane. Below these atmospheric layers, a super hot or super dense fluid of icy materials such as water, methane and ammonia wraps around the planet's core. Calculations and experiments dating back the decades have shown that with sufficient pressure and temperature, methane can be broken down into diamonds suggesting that the diamonds can form within this hot, dense material. Scientists also say that Jupiter and Saturn may also contain diamonds produced under such conditions, though they contain proportionally less methane when comparing to Neptune and Uranus. Neptune and Uranus are estimated to contain around more than 15% of methane under an outer atmosphere of hydrogen and helium. If you are new to my channel, subscribe my channel for more videos.